Pisces. This is a weird video because I'm driving, as you can see. So pretty much you might be able to see me, and then again, you might not be able to see me, but don't focus on my face anyway. Listen to the message. Um, I just wanted to tell you that if you're wondering why things are not going right in your life, it very well might be because you have a spirit of fear on you. And pretty much, you know, anytime that you have a spirit of fear on you, that gives birth to all other types of ailments, such as anxiety, such as self-doubt, such as low self-esteem, such as backbiting, jealousy, all of these different things. But majority of the things that we deal with, the, the core of that issue is fear. So that might be why you're not reaching your goals because you're actually scared to reach your goals. <laughs> That's probably why. You're scared to step out there. You're scared to, you know, really, really do what it takes to make it happen because it's, it's going into excuse me, uncharted territory, a place you've never been before. So it can be scary, you know, decisions have to be made. And sometimes when you're, when you're on the path, the journey towards truth and the journey towards being a better person, just being a better person, you know, you do get scared, but don't let, don't let the enemy fool you with fear and make you stop being awesome and make you stop striving for your goals because he will the enemy the enemy presents fear and other things that you know agitate us those thorns in our side he presents those to us like it's a package so if you can just imagine a Christmas present with a big red bow on it and he puts it and you're in a room think of like the matrix <laughs> you're in a white room and in front of you is a box and it's a beautiful box and it's wrapped up beautifully with a bow and everything and he puts it right in front of you you know you have to make the choice open up the box or keep walking around it leave it but a lot of us, we, we open up that box, which is actually filled with fear and anxiety. It's a gift from the enemy. We open it, we pick, the, we pick the box up, and we start walking with the box. But we make the choice to do that. I just want to let you know that you have a choice. And that you, that you do not have to pick up the box you don't have to open the box leave the box where it is it's time for you to take your life to the next level it's time it's time to let go of the fear i'm letting go of mine i strive every day i'm telling you self-control is like the best thing that i ever found <laughs> and the more i practice self-control the more and more my life seems to come together but in order for me to practice self-control I have to deal with my my issues, my fear and my anxiety because self-control is being able to have dominion over oneself. And when you start getting shaky and fearful, you're able to calm yourself down. You don't need to take a pill. You don't need to, you know, do something crazy because you're having anxiety. You can literally tell yourself, I am not anxious. <laughs> I am not anxious when those feelings start to come. Let's let's say you're having some feelings and it's saying about your finances. And you you say, I'm broke, I'm broke, I'm broke. You keep saying that you're broke. So guess what? You're bro you are broke. But what you need to do instead of when you start thinking those thoughts about your finances, I am not broke, I am wealthy. I am wealthy. I have everything that I need. And that's how you make the inner enemy within yourself. That's how you get rid of that, that fear spirit. The enemy will shrink when you counteract the very thing that he or she or it has given to you. You do the opposite of it, even when it's hard. But anyway, I believe in you. I love you. And keep pushing, okay? Keep pushing. It's worth it. Don't stop. Love you. Bye.